A little more than a year after being sentenced for sexually abusing two teenage girls, a former Powell County youth minister is now accused of violating his probation. Steve Williams was back in a courtroom today for a probation revocation hearing. Claire Crouch has the details. You told the court that you wanted to look into the group a bit because you weren't familiar with it, and you did all those things. With little fanfare and no one but Steve Williams' family looking on, his sex abuse treatment counselor detailed the ways she says Williams violated his contract with the court-appointed treatment facility, as well as his probation. She says in December, emails were intercepted by Williams' probation officer, indicating he was seeking unapproved treatment, as well as communicating with a convicted felon, which is violation of his probation. But from a treatment perspective, when we put these things together, what we're saying is a cycle of abuse. In addition to that, she says emails also showed his plans to create a new ministry, putting him in a leadership role among vulnerable people. She says this demonstrates risky behavior. Mr. Williams does not need less treatment. He needs more treatment. Williams was sentenced in November of 2016. The former youth minister and bus driver was convicted of sexually assaulting two girls on a whitewater rafting trip in 2015. You don't have any evidence that he actually disobeyed your instructions. Despite Williams' attorney claiming there was no real evidence to prove his client had violated anything, both sides eventually agreed Williams should enter into home incarceration and continue to receive treatment. The judge will have the final say on March 21st. Covering the news in Powell County, Claire Crouch, LEX 18 News.